This is MSJ Chem. In this video, I'll be looking at ocean acidification. Approximately 30% of anthropogenic carbon dioxide is absorbed by the oceans. Therefore, the oceans are known as a carbon sink. A heterogeneous equilibrium exists between concentrations of gaseous carbon dioxide in the atmosphere and aqueous carbon dioxide dissolved in the oceans. This equation shows the equilibrium that exists between gaseous carbon dioxide in the atmosphere and aqueous carbon dioxide dissolved in the oceans. According to Le Chatelier's principle, if a change is made to a system at equilibrium, the position of equilibrium will shift to minimize the effects of the change. Therefore, if the concentration of gaseous carbon dioxide in the atmosphere increases, the position of equilibrium will shift to the right and more carbon dioxide will dissolve in the oceans. The dissolved carbon dioxide reacts with water to form H2CO3 which is carbonic acid. Carbonic acid is a weak acid which partially dissociates in solution to produce aqueous hydrogen ions. This equation shows the dissociation of carbonic acid to form aqueous hydrogen ions and the hydrogen carbonate ion. The increasing concentration of hydrogen ions causes the pH of the oceans to decrease. In a previous video we saw that pH equals the negative log of the hydrogen ion concentration. Therefore the higher concentration of hydrogen ions the lower the pH. Since the beginning of the industrial revolution the pH of the oceans has decreased by 0.1 pH units. Continued acidification of the oceans could have harmful effects on marine organisms.